Coach 4-5 here at Battle Box Welders, and I just want to give you a couple of quick tips on hand placement when you're utilizing the battle ropes. So here we have two uh, battle ropes. You have the two rubber handles at the top, and basically if you're doing movements such as our battle rope twist, when you have your hands at the base of the, the handles and you're twisting, you're doing a pivot with your foot rotation, it's best to have your hands up under the grips, not too far of it when you have a lot of slack in it. Basically, you just want to have your, your, your palms right here up under the deep grip here. Hands stay together when you're doing the movement. Twist it from side to side to get that maximum usage out of that grip, of that exercise. A uh, couple of other tips you want to know uh, is basically if we're doing alternate hand rows, alternate rows here with the, work, the, with the battle ropes, you want your hands to be in the middle of the grip, not too far up, not here at the base of it, but you want your hands to be right here in the middle of it. So give that a try when the next time when you utilize the battle rope. Squat it down some, back stay straight, and basically you just do the motion here. Now it's gonna look a little different if you're stiffening your arms, go about it and just change the pattern of your weight. Uh, one last tip, if you're doing exercises on the ground where you're in a seated position, the same thing goes for say. So basically position yourself far enough back so we don't have too much slack in the battle ropes. You want to have your hands again here in the middle of the grips where you can have better control of it when you're utilizing the exercise. Double hand slams here or you're alternating it here. So just another quick tip from Coach 4-5 here at Battle Box Wellness. See you soon.